Welcome to our comprehensive guide on constructing a simplified sewer system. Let's delve into the step-by-step -step methodology to ensure a successful and efficient installation. A simplified sewer is a sewerage network that is constructed using smaller diameter pipes laid at a shallower depth and at a flatter gradient than conventional sewers. The simplified sewer allows for a more flexible design that is better adapted to the local situation at but lower costs. The pipes are usually laid within the property boundaries, through either the back or front yards, rather than beneath the central road, allowing for fewer and shorter pipes. Simplified sewers can be installed in almost all types of settlements and are especially appropriate for dense urban areas where space for on-site primary treatment units. The technical steps are Pre-construction Project team formation Preliminary site assessments Community engagement and mobilization Water level and sanitation service level assessments Identification of the project area and scope, subdividing the area into blocks. Checking on the pipe sizing and material selection. Cost estimation. Excavation marks the beginning of trenching. It's crucial to conduct a thorough survey to maintain the proper slope, as sewer systems rely on gravity flow. A 2% slope is ideal and any deviation can lead to backflow or improper drainage. Upon completion of construction, the system needs to be operated and maintained, including monitoring, inspection, cleaning, and repair. It is important to engage the community where the simplified sewer will be installed. It encourages community acceptance, active participation, and long-term sustainable use of the simplified sewer system. The steps to follow are Stakeholder analysis To identify and understand the key stakeholders involved in the implementation and utilization of the simplified sewer system. Community needs assessment Conduct a thorough assessment to identify the specific needs, preferences, and challenges of the community regarding sanitation and the use of sewer system. Awareness and education campaigns. Develop and implement an awareness and education campaign to inform the community about the benefits, functioning, and importance of the simplified sewer system. Community engagement and participation. Facilitate meaningful community engagement and participation throughout the different stages of the project. Behavior change communication. Develop behavior change communication materials and strategies to promote good hygiene practices such as hand washing, waste management, and proper use and maintenance of toilets connected to the simplified sewer system. Equity and inclusivity. Addressed the needs and concerns of vulnerable groups such as women, children, and people with disabilities to ensure equal access and benefits for all community members. Capacity building. Empower the community with the knowledge and skills necessary for the proper management of the simplified sewer system. Monitoring and evaluation. Established a robust monitoring and evaluation framework to assess the progress and effectiveness of the social component. As the simplified sewer is unconventional, it is important to promote and raise awareness about this innovative and cost-effective sewage solution. The marketing component looks at highlighting the benefits, addressing community needs through various marketing channels. Training of marketing assistants and sociologists. To educate the community on the advantages of connecting to the network. Information dissemination. Distribution of informative materials such as brochures, pamphlets, and leaflets. Personalized engagement. Face-to-face -face meetings with community members. In WSUP's experience, achieving citywide sanitation coverage requires a menu of services, including sewer and on-site. The most appropriate technology and service delivery model may vary based on the characteristics of each settlement, or even within settlements.
Conceptually, simplified sewer systems have several strengths that can make them well suited to densely populated informal settlements. These include relatively low costs, flexible pipes to enable maneuverability, and ease of connection. It must be emphasized that simplified sewer systems require specific conditions in place to be effective, including adequate water supply to support poor flush toilets, strong community engagement to support effective system maintenance, and the existence of trunk sewer networks to which these systems can be connected. However, customer satisfaction with the model was found to be high, and the model is viewed as both sustainable and scalable by the mandated city authorities.